Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from Chief Meteorologist Don Slater. We could see an isolated shower or two coming up for the day tomorrow. It'll be a little warmer. Today was uh, most of the day was 47 degrees, 47, 48 degrees. Uh, this morning it was in the low 50s, so it wasn't that bad. But then uh, 47, 48, drizzle, dreary. But we're going to see more sunshine coming up, and we're going to see things warm on up. The nice thing about what's going on is that you can still go outside and be free. Uh, you can have the kids outside, and you can also uh, just go for a long walk. The sunshine will do you good. And if you can't walk, if you're uh, shut in, you can't uh, can't really get outside, uh, you can at least sit by the window and have a little sunlight come in uh, over the next couple of days. And I think you're going to have the windows open over the next few days as well. Here's what's going on. Rain chances are not big for the day. Tomorrow, you see some of the stray sprinkles and drizzle over our area earlier. There's a low pressure here, which is climbing northward. It's a very weak one. We've been watching it now for a week, thinking oh, it might take off and get big, but it's not likely to now. Uh, it'll move on through just offshore, coming up for the overnight hours in the first part of the day tomorrow. At 11 o'clock, here's where this version of Future Track has got it, right underneath all of this stuff, right on into here. Anyway, it's going to move on off, and most of it's going to stay offshore. Uh, we'll see a northeast wind at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Now, there is some rain off to the west, but it'll tend to get chewed up uh, by this storm. The storm will have a, a some sinking air on the other side of it. So we might see skies clear off for a time. Temperatures dropping on down. And what rain there is likely to drop through parts of northeast North Carolina, but fall apart as it does so. There's where things are at four in the afternoon. I'm, this is going 61, 63. I'm going 62 for a high temperature for the day tomorrow. So that's going to be warmer than what we saw for the day today. Still a lot of cloudiness into the area, but still a good day to go out and take a walk uh, and, enjoy, and enjoy that 62 degree weather. 7 o'clock in the evening, tomorrow evening. Here comes cold front. So it'll warm up a little bit for tomorrow, but then it'll cool down again tomorrow night with maybe a stray shower or two uh, during the overnight hours. And then it'll stay a little cooler for Wednesday. But we're going highs for 59 degrees for a high temperature coming up during the afternoon on Wednesday. So a little bit up tomorrow, a tiny bit down coming up for the day on Wednesday. But then temperatures are just going to skyrocket coming up for Thursday and Friday. Thursday, pretty decent shot at some rainfall into the area, not a washout. Friday, how about it? How about things going? Yeah, we're going to slight chance of rain there. But we're going to be well into the 70s. Here's 7 o'clock in the evening. I think we'll likely be into the mid to upper 70s for the day on Friday. Saturday, a little cooler, northerly wind, uh, and you can see that wind kicking in a bit and then dying off a little bit by Sunday. Uh, the low cloud cover, not much for drizzle though. Uh, during the late afternoon hours, once we hit about the dinner hour, the drizzle fell apart and it hasn't been with us for a while. 45, 47 degrees. Most of these temperature readings were about the same as they were at 6 o'clock. The only difference being Williamsburg. Williamsburg was quite a bit warmer at 54. Otherwise, temperatures were around 45, 48 degrees. And they're not going to drop too much more than they have uh, already. They'll drop a couple more degrees, and that's about it. We still got cloud cover into the region, and we'll see things warm up for the day tomorrow. But tonight, cool, cloudy, cool. Light rain and drizzle is possible. It's not going to dominate. We'll see 44 to 48 for a low. 62 degrees coming up for tomorrow. We could see a stray shower coming up mainly tomorrow morning, and really I'm tending to think about dropping that to just 20%. There's not a real big chance of rain going on there. A better chance of rain coming up on Thursday. 76, though, and then 81 on Friday.